Welcome back to the fourth quarter of the Bobby Dupre Show. Hope you've enjoyed the first uh, three quarters. And uh, my sidekick, Andrew, says he's ready to roll. We've got some films, but we want to get, uh, we have any sponsors left? Or we oh, we've we got plenty. Let's go to Dixie Storage. All your storage needs, personal and commercial, throughout St. Landry Parish with access to I-49, 190, Washington Highway, Port Barriopolis is in Washington. They've got certified scales, railroad spur access. They've got a short line trucking company that can help deliver your delivery within this area. They do inventory control for you all throughout the parish, handle Fortune 500 companies as well. Go buy Dixie Storage and don't forget their sister company, A Plus Glass, with locations in Lafayette and in Opelousas. Boy, that was pretty good. Quarters e Casino. I'm like a pro oh, today. I'm Quarters Casino. Man, go buy there. And the Quarters Casino, you know what it's all about. Put in your quarter, get out your dollar. You can win some money in those good machines. Go to El Pico de Gallo, authentic Mexican uh, cuisine in the little cantina there inside. Great for and margaritas and on the rocks mm -hmm. got great flan if you like some of that good dessert they had a whole travel plaza there where they've got subway crispy crunchy chicken some pizza type stuff there as well stuckey's candy they've got good chevron fuel well lit well covered you can't go wrong go by the quarters casino and tell mr pat willis we said i hi. saw mr pat and i thanked him and he says i'm thanking you all he said i love the program he watches it himself too there you go so and, uh, good morning to you and mr. that's what pat. we get a few when we go north to, to, to yeah, and I'm gonna be stopping by there I'm going hopefully, to I'm, uh, well going oh, hunting I'm going hunting eating pies at least pies Eat, whatever you're doing yeah. up north stop by there on your way through how about Targill one last sponsor we miss mr. Ted Bellard he had a business meeting this morning but he sent us each a text I think he to said, congratulate us on a big project again put the, put the check in the mail and I believe his check is in the oh, mail. his check he, is he, in the mail his checks are good we he saw, had planned we saw on coming. we saw mr. AC at the event this the morning, dad the whole Bellard family Targill, go by Targill if you need seasoning and supplies for your restaurant, your outdoor kitchen, your uh, grocery store. They got seasoning, butcher supplies, cutlery, kitchen supplies. They'll do uh, unique blends. I know uh, David Link over at the OPAC Financial Services uses a special blend and promotes his company that way. A guy comes in and gets a loan or does something there, they give him a can of OPAC season. So during the year, your name is there on the counter reminding your customer about all the good things that you do for them. And if you're a cook, maybe, if you're a restaurant, if you're a grocery store, you got your own blend, you need, they got their own recipes that will help you as well. Go by Targill. A funeral uh, service was held November the 23rd. That's a couple of, that's Saturday a week ago. Uh, and uh, this was held for uh, Aaron Laverne, age uh, 77, a longtime friend of mine. Uh, years ago, we all were in the uh, antique uh, auto club, and uh, he and his wife, Miss Ivy, uh, we how to say that we passed some good good times and uh, hadn't seen him in a, in a while but uh, certainly want to offer my deepest sympathies uh, to Miss Ivy and family and friends and uh, sorry I wasn't able to attend the uh, wake and funeral services mm -hmm. uh, another person who didn't really say know him but I, I know of the name it's a local Italian name Carlo Lucito mm -hmm. and uh, Mr. Carlo was uh, nine 83, wow. a uh, little bit older than me, and uh, so he was ahead of me in school. Uh, and uh, he, uh, of course, lived most of his life right here in, and worked uh, most of his life locally. I see where he worked for Wolf Sunbeam Bakery in Lafayette, that's local, and uh, also worked for Opelousas Motor Supply. And I'm trying to think of uh, the, the older gentleman, J.B. LeBlanc, was one of the owners, and there was a, a God, I can't think of his name, but uh, anyhow, uh, he was a, a li little older gentleman and, mm -hmm. and probably Mr. Carlo's uh, good friend. Our deepest sympathies. And another person who uh, I noticed died was uh, Preston Leger Jr. Uh, he was only age uh, 68, and uh, it says here he was raised by his grandmother, Mr. Arthur, Mrs. Uh, Arthur uh, Ela. Uh, Leger, uh, after his mother passed away, and uh, he has one of his sisters. I recognized uh, uh, the name of uh, Wilda Cosgrove, mm -hmm. and that's Marty Cosgrove's uh, uh, mama, uh, Miss Wilda. So, to, to that family, uh, my deepest uh, of sympathies. 
we've got the Dial and Toy Fund you and I talked about earlier. Ms. Janice Corville, I guess, is kind of the, the, the head person that kind of helps push the project. Uh, the Dial and Toy Fund is taking donations right now. Monetary donations can be mailed to Janice Corville at 1826 Edward Street, Opelousas, Louisiana, 70570. It's all the Catholic daughters here that have done this since the First World War, helping give toys to needy people. They also welcome not just donations, but new toys. Bring them to Valentin Hall at St. Landry Catholic Church anytime during the office hours of, of the church. 789-0971 for more help. I congratulated her and uh, all of the uh, friends of hers that do this uh, annually and uh, been very, very successful and they try to make sure that every child in our community has at least one toy. That's right. Also want to remind folks, our monthly men's mass you and I go to, Keith Abear, kind of our, our, our leader in that project, is going to be next Tuesday, December the 10th at 6.30 p.m. That's Tuesday night at Valentin Hall at St. Landry Catholic Church. So if you want to come by, just send me an RSVP type thing so I know what's going on at our email here or call me at 351-0732. Get a good head count because we like to cook a little supper afterwards. A couple of weeks ago, uh, Hunter Hayes, uh, our own, uh, I guess, star, a music, mu musician star. Mm -hmm. In fact, uh, he's probably getting as well known, if not better known, as a songwriter, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, can play any instrument, can can do the production work in the studio. Just a very very talented young man. And he, he went through that that growth phase where the voice was changing, and w instead of just being depressed about it while it was happening, and the voice got beautiful once once he went through the change, he went to work in the studio. And it's interesting to me. He just kept working on his skill set. So when he got the voice back. Just beautiful, I mean, beautiful work he did. Brobridge native, yeah. and of course I knew his dad, I know his dad and Mr. Leo. Mr. Leo, uh, full-time working alongside of his son, mm -hmm. working for his son, taking for care of son. all the little things our, that Our friend to Larry Leger would loan him his RV and let him just roll around the country wherever it, it, they and, could go. And had Mr. Leo on the pay working. Yeah, he yeah. Wor Leo worked for, uh, for Larry, Larry for years. Mm -hmm. So anyhow, I kind of feel like we, you know, we know him special. Uh, uh, they came out and and uh, he came out and enter entertained our group uh, on the squirrel hunt that we used mm -hmm. to have uh, over at uh, the Red Dirt. Let's show a few more photos. I'm going to kick back to the Breakfast with Santa. Remind you, P.O. Box 7 if you want to send a donation. Some of the kids that were there, this picture's a little blurry. I'll have better pictures next week. But this is Connor that has gone to the clinic for years as a little bitty child. Look how tall he is today and even has his driver's permit. He oh, was he, was, he showed us his so, driver's so permit. So when, when you go from not sure if you're going to be able to walk, to being a full-grown young man that can drive and everything. Just go to show you that, that your donations to the Cerebral Palsy Clinic, the good impact they make. And there you are with one, one of the other children, uh, your brother Cody, and our good friend, the tax assessor, Ryan Duplachan. There are chefs working in the kitchen in the line, and uh, some of our servers running around there, too. If I can see some of the faces, I see Jim Lopez, I see Don Stanford, I think that's, uh, is that Greg uh, Doucette in the back? Hard for me to say. And, and Billy Jarrell, who has helped us every Every year, it's 10 years. Billy's one of the first people there. Never call him, never ask for help. Billy's first guy there. Yeah. And so we just, we appreciate it. Wife Carolyn was great, there. Great and there I, he is with a plate full of yeah, food there. I, I, I congratulated uh, Billy to, to his wife. I said, what a great he guy. really, we, we don't even have to call him. He just, he's that first on, first man in Mitch line. Olivier, Jim Lopez, uh, Jason Hugay, Joey Quibodeau, uh, Chef Ernest Prejean, Ray uh, Bello. Uh, I'm switching through Scott Pete right there as well with Imperial Fire and Casualty. And the Father Brady talking to Ms. D. Boudreaux as well. How about Freddie Herpin with the Daily World? Thank you, Freddie, for all the good coverage you give us. Yeah, as we, well. had a, we had a front page uh, uh, article this morning. Uh, this morning. Help remind everybody, which remind. is fantastic. We thank them. And, and this get, is Gerard. Yeah. And we've got uh, some of the guys from FM Bank with there as well. Tony and, and right. uh, Mark. Tony's all over those billboards in town. You've been seeing those billboards that they said, Tony's at FM Bank. Come on down. So I said, morning, how's Tony. Fred to work with? He said, fantastic. He says, you, Fred's a character. You, Fred he Mills. He says, you see, yeah, the, the president. Sen Senator and president uh, there and, uh, what a, and a pharmacist as well. As yeah, well. yeah. yeah. Uh, just a, a, a handful of fun. How about uh, Lindsay, Lindsay Lee, Lee and his baby girl, uh, Miss Melanie Lee? Good <laughs> morning. 
and she's with, of course, uh, the the uh, Vieux Village and and the uh, the tourism. the tourism at the city of Opelousas. And there's Father Brady and married to Craig LaBeouf. That's correct. Miss, Mr. Lee always tease him. Uh, and we got Father Brady with St. Landry Church and Miss Carolyn for Corey as well. Father Brady did a nice opening prayer for us with our event. And look, Miss Kelly Dupre. Oh, Good morning, can, coffee can, and right. mimosas oh, with, with see, Terry man. Guidry over at our OPAC Recovery Center as well. A lot of photos of the kids all getting therapy. I got about a dozen photos left if y'all want to bear with me. But we had overflowing to other rooms. There's our ladies, uh, Miss Betty Foray, uh, Miss Gwen uh, Fruge, and Miss Yvonne Norman, who helped us over at the front desk. And do every year. Every year, we've got a Barn and the crew with Whitney Bank that's there every year. There's our buddy again, Major. There is Charles. Goins with a uh, lovely Jade, Jade. and then there's there's uh, Pat Morrow and uh, Judge Jim Darty and look even I got in on the picture. Oh yeah, look at that. That that'll sell at Walmart oh, Monday morning. And we're all good boys. We wouldn't be with Santa Claus if we wasn't good little <laughs> boys, right? right? And there's Chad Bello with Coach Armand Castile. And I, I, Chad doesn't miss an event. But I uh, also want to thank Coach Armin for all he does to help Chad get to these events. You know, Ray has to cook at these things, so Ray can't always get Chad to come out at 5 o'clock in the morning. And, and, That's but, a good but point. Armin always brings him You're out right. to good uh, thank point. Mr. Armin, Coach Armin, for that. And Miss here, Sally and Reed. Sally Reed. I and forgot to ask her how what, ran there. Was she on her bike? No, she no? wasn't on right, a bike. Right. Uh, but your cousin was. Phyllis was, Stanford. Phyllis Stanford was on well, her bike. Sure, that's what I told her. I and said. that's not a bicycle, that's a motorcycle. That's right. I got them cousins. A motorcycle, that do that. like the old ones used and to call them. And we got Sherry McGovern, the chief deputy there at, uh, at uh, St. Larry Parish Sheriff's Department. Chief and the Civil. High, chief Civil Deputy, correct. And uh, the High Sheriff, Bobby Guidros, and some of our buddies outside, Nutsy Quirk, uh, Bobby Le Bourgeois. Uh, I'm kicking over. KTC came out, Channel 3. So if you watch Channel 3 News, you may have seen the whole Breakfast with Santa and event. And you They've catch it at 5. A lot of coverage and six. this year. And there's baby Jack uh, Busby. That's uh, my cousin Heidi's little boy that's there. And look at all the people. And there's our buddy Kendall Broussard with Timeline Builders. My partner. Your partner in the building business. And right here we got uh, Jimmy Dozat, who is the uh, director at Our Lady of the Oaks Retreat House and an attorney. And Don Stanford running around as well. And there's Baby Jack again with my cousin Heidi uh, Stanford and you and uh, some of the ladies that were all there, all smiling, all having a good time. How about Clerk of Court Charlie Jogno? I'm still whipping through. I'm almost there. There's Chad Bello with you. There's Coach Armin and his lovely wife. And how about Keith Abair with his Three Stooges tie on? He said that's Bobby <laughs> Andrew and David Link is what he said when he was showing. <laughs> and some of the other kids that, that get good help at the clinic, uh, Terry Guidry. I'm down to almost the end. That's Noel and his lovely uh, friend, friend uh, Carla. 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 From uh, Chile from and Chile. Vicky and Bobby. And we've got Camille uh, Boudreau who has had who walks wonderfully, who they said would never walk, walks wonderfully. Good morning, Camille and Kelly Dupre with you as well. Papa Tat, Jim Tatman there, he got you. He's sitting on my oh, lap. he's telling you what he wants for Christmas. Well, that's I see correct, that. exactly what and he's doing. there's little Lindsay Bear again, and look, look, look at her patting Santa Claus. She's patting you. <laughs> Love Santa Claus. Lindsay is just a sweetheart that goes to the clinic. We want to thank the guys who did all the work too, of course. Uh, uh, from Harry Gabriel on the left, we got Matthew on the right, and we got Mr. Troy. Young Troy right there in the center. And then you had one in other. 30 minutes, the place had they had taken everything apart, and uh, this photo. this is four generations uh, over in Pecan Island at their camp, and I, 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 I know I have it here somewhere. Uh, we'll, we'll get them next week, is what we'll do, because at the end you're going to find your prayer. I uh, have it. Prepared. And we want to thank Is, everybody again. Don't forget about helping us with Breakfast with Santa, P.O. Box 70. This weekend, like every weekend, uh, please consider attending the church of your choice. And for the prayer for the week, uh, I close with, Instill within my heart, dear Lord, a deep desire to know your word. I want to learn to hear your voice, that I may make your will my choice. And uh, I want to thank you, Andrew, thank you. and I want to thank all the people that have helped us so, so much with the, the drive, uh, CP Clinic uh, Money Drive, Breakfast Drive, and uh, thank all of you.